such a magical moment. Agumbe always sticks in my head. Coming back 30 years later, and Agumbe has lost none of its magic. This is a whole forest of reed bamboo. In my experience, this is the kind of place where a king cobra makes her nest. The leaves just seem just right for her to be able to make her nest with. To me, this is like the sanctum sanctorum for king cobras. Just about 30 yards over there is a pair of king cobras. One is big, one is small. Definitely a male and a female, and this is the right time of year. This is the time they court and mate. Come on, just slowly, very slowly. Snakes have no ears. I mean, I, I can talk loud. <laughs> the snake can't hear me. But any fast movement, they'll be able to detect it, and it might disturb this activity. And that we don't want to happen. And in this case, wearing a large red shirt doesn't really make any difference either. These guys are colorblind. They're more or less oblivious to anything around them right now. They're concentrating on courtship. The female is doing something we call submissive behavior. She spreads her hood, she lies low, and then she actually tries to hide her head under her own coil sometimes. The whole process takes about an hour. the size difference, now you can really see it. He's huge, like he's close to 11 feet long, and she may be what, about eight or nine feet maybe? She's starting to move off. They've finished mating, and she's going her own way. Now they'll be alone again. This is the only time they meet up and stay together. The male seems to be resting now. Eventually he'll be basking, getting back his strength, and of course feeding and going on to find the next female, I guess. That's what he'll probably be after right now. The female has now been impregnated, and his sperm is now fertilizing the eggs inside her. There may be 20 or 30 eggs inside her, and in 40 days, she's gonna be gathering leaves together to make her nest in the fantastic way that only king cobras do. And I'm gonna be back here in 40 days to find that nest. The countless interrelationships